No way! No way! No way! No way! Bro! What the fuck? Bro! It's right there! Holy shit! No way! There are four types of solar eclipses. This event, a total solar eclipse, occurs when the moon completely blocks the face of the sun by passing between it and Earth. People in the middle of the moon's shadow will experience a total eclipse, meaning the sky will darken as if it were dusk or dawn. They'll see the sun's corona or outer atmosphere, which is usually blocked by the sun's bright face. Next up, the annular solar eclipse. This is what many people saw back in October. This also happens when the moon is between sun and earth, but this time the moon is at its furthest point away from earth. This means it doesn't completely cover the sun and it's often called the ring of fire eclipse. Eclipse glasses have to be kept on the whole time for these. Depending on where you are, including all of Connecticut this time, you may experience a partial solar eclipse. This happens during both a solar and annular eclipse when you are outside the area covered by the moon. You'll see part of the sun covered, giving it a crescent shape. Lastly, a hybrid solar eclipse. Because the Earth is curved, there are times an eclipse can switch between an annular and total solar eclipse as it moves across the globe. My goodness, this is nuts. Look at this. Holy mackerel. Wow. That looks fake. Look how dark it is. Wow, that is so cool. Whoa! This literally is unreal. You could see a star. You could see multiple stars. Look at that. Oh my.